Sataro Fukiage is one of the first recorded Japanese serial killers and rapists. He killed at least seven girls, but is suspected of many more. The most accurate guess is that Sataro started murdering in 1906. Then it took several years from 1923 to 1924. That last year alone Sataro killed at least six girls. Assuming he was active from 1906 to 1924 with the same average numbers his victim count could be as high as 108, which supports most of theories both offered by armchair detectives and professionals. Fukiage was born in Shimojioku, Kyoto. His childhood started as many kids those days. His family forced him to work from the early age of nine. This was under the East Asian Age Reckoning. Simply said it means the time in the mother's womb is also counted so a person is one to two years older than when you counted from the date of birth. Maybe good to know, South Korea stopped using this method of counting as of June 28, 2023. Fukiich had many jobs, but when he was about 11 he had sex with a 17 years old girl and was fired for it. When he was 12, he was already arrested for theft, which earned him two months of jail time, time he used to learn kana and math. Soon after his release, he was arrested again and started learning classic Chinese. Released again years passed without having real troubles with the law. At the age of 17, he had sex with a 54-year-old woman. In the aftermath of this, he also raped the woman's 11-year-old daughter and successfully assaulted several other children in the neighborhood. Fukiich found himself in Kinkakuji on September 24, 1906. There he raped and murdered an 11-year-old girl he knew well from before. He was counted 18 years old, but was 17 under the law system and was given a fairly light sentence of 16 years in jail. Again, he used that time to study. He enriched his knowledge with the works of Confucius, Mencius, Socrates, Aristoteles, and Nichiren. After his release, he quickly found a job, but lost it soon because of his criminal past. In April 1923, he was arrested for molesting a four-year-old girl, but was surprisingly released. It would not take long before the demons in Fukiage would go full throttle. Between June 1923 and April 1924, he brutally raped and murdered six girls ranging in age from 11 to 16. He was arrested on July 28, 1924. He initially confessed to 13 murders, but would later withdraw that and changed his story and insisted he only murdered six girls. Eventually, he was sentenced to the death penalty on May 17, 1925. The execution itself was not until September 28, 1926. He was executed by hanging. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe for more. We post one video each week and three shorts a week. Stay curious and check out our other videos too.